it's not just a headache. Obviously, there is head pain associated with migraine, uh, but migraine is a severe throbbing headache, and it has a whole bunch of stuff that goes with it, including nausea, sometimes vomiting, light and noise sensitivity. I think the most striking thing about migraine is the level of disability that patients suffer with. So I always call it a time robber. Um, migraines can last anywhere from four hours to three days. Ooh. And really, um, it just takes so much time out of a migraineer's life. It tends to be a genetic disorder. Um, but there are about 40 million Americans who have mig migraine. Migraine used to be thought to be some neurotic disorder, like if you just got your life together and stop worrying, you might not have it. The reality is that that's not true. Again, it's genetically transmitted. We actually know exactly what's happening in the brain today. And because of that, we have much better therapies. We talked a little bit about light. What other kind of things trigger migraines in people? So overstimulation or stress. Um, um, I, a good way to think about it is that a migraine brain likes things regular. So change in sleep patterns, skipping meals, overindulging on, say, sugar or alcohol. Um, uh, head trauma can do it. Weather changes are big for patients. Um, and certain foods can be triggers as well. Um, there's a huge list of things that can do it. So obviously, you know, if you if you keep the same schedule, which, you know, it's nice, but we can't all do that all the time. What are the things can you do to prevent them? Well, I think, again, one of the things I talk to my patients about is to, you know, at least recognize what your triggers are so that um, you can minimize the ones that you do have control over. Obviously, we can't control the weather. We can't control if our shift goes too long at work. You know, there's all kinds of things. The baby's crying and has an earache, all kinds of things that, you know, we don't plan in our day. Um, but to try to make sure that the things you can control, you do. And now we have some super effective medications that are really, really helpful for patients. Yeah, I have a friend who uh, gets uh, Botox for migraines, but that isn't something that you can do, say it's onset and you need to treat it right away with like a Tylenol. And I know Tylenol doesn't work, but what does work for migraines? So the really exciting thing is we've identified a neuropeptide, a transmitter in the brain that if we uh, block it, we can actually stop a migraine. And so one of the medicines we're talking about today or the medicine we're talking about today is Nurtec ODT, which is an orally disintegrating tablet. So it gets absorbed very quickly um, and can go and block that CGRP from sending the pain messages patients get with migraine. Um, and the lovely thing about that is that you can take it when you have a migraine and you can also use it to prevent migraine. So it's the first medicine of its kind that can do both things. And it's super exciting because a lot of patients will say, well, I don't wanna have to take medicine every day for my migraines. Uh, I don't have them that often. Um, but then having that flexibility for when they are in a situation, like it's the holidays, you're running around, your sleep patterns off, um, all those different things that can kind of trigger, you could actually take it preventatively during that time when you're at risk. I know a lot of medications that you take um, can you know, take effect within 20, 30 minutes. Can that happen with this as well? Right, we see it working very, very quickly. Um, we can see it work as quickly as an hour um, and it has sustained efficacy, which in English for all <laughs> of us means like it'll last for up to two days. So it's really an amazing medication because it, it, it works at the front end when the headache starts, but then it protects you down the road a piece so that the headache doesn't come back. All right, for more information on migraines and Nurtec ODT, go to nurtec.com. Two days, that is amazing. That's good, isn't it? Yeah. Yeah, wow.